the account payable department in many organization has to deal with many paper based invoices coming out of the different channels and employee has to figure out the type of the invoice like it's a purchase order or a non purchase order based on the type of the invoices they need to redirect for appropriate action taker as well as if it is a non purchase order they have to do a buyer coding on top of it so this whole process is the time consuming as well as the data entry at the end he has to take and care of all the process has been completed well or not and then he can take a action and send the data to the eps in this whole process sometime invoices get lost as well as there will be a human error at the time of the data entry and that will add a cost to the company at the end as naresh pointed out that this process has lot of uh, problems um we are going to tackle this problem using our integration cloud service which include process and insight analytics before going into the demo let's introduce who are the personas who are going to participate in this particular demo so we have uh, so we have buyer who is joy he is the person who bought the item for his personal use uh, we have the manager who is going to approve uh, whatever joy has bought and we have accounts payable uh, data entry person who is rene uh, she is going to take care of paying the seller i am going to play a role of a rene she is the data entry person into the account payable department in the company over here i am already logged into the oracle content and experience cloud services where i will get all the invoices that need to be taken care of it so i can see i have a new invoices that need to be taken care let me go and see the details about the invoice so i can see the invoice here as well as content and experience cloud services manage to capture all the metadata of the invoices so you can see it's been captured here and i can see status has not been started yet so i need to start the invoice processing so just simply i just need to click here and start the process so as i start the process it will trigger a process cloud on the back end side and it will send this invoice to appropriate person based on the type of the invoice like if it is a purchase order it will go into the manager to approve if it is a non purchase order it will go for a buyer accounting as the uh, invoice that naresh triggered since that was the non purchase order i got an email which says that the buyer has to complete the coding i'll go ahead and click on view online i can see uh, that this particular invoice it has uh, invoice type invoice number and all the details has been filled all i have to do is uh, click on this account coding drop down and do the account coding for that particular line item i can add more line items if i want and if i want to uh, go and check the original invoice i can click on this icon button over here and it, and it, and you can see that it pulls up the original invoice for the time being i'm going to click on complete as i have done the account coding now once the account coding is done uh, the manager who was john he has to approve this particular invoice as john there is a new task in my queue that i need to approve i'll go ahead and click on that particular task i see that the account coding has been completed by the buyer i can go ahead and click on uh, approve now as the manager has uh, has approved this particular invoice it goes back to rene the manager has been approved the invoice so now i will get back that invoice with all information that was required so let me go and see the invoice i can see the invoice has been processed let me click here okay i can see the whole details about the invoice the account coding has been done i can write the comment as well as check the history let me go and see the inside of the invoice so this graph shows all the milestone has been captured for this invoice you can see it's been approved by the manager here if you click on that you will be able to see who has approved this invoice and and every details that is required for a data entry to take a decision so simply let me go and submit the invoice as i have all the details that is required now let's say if i am the i am the head of the accounts payable department and i want to know that what the st- what the state of my department once i log in as the administrator i can click on invoice processing and i can see um all the invoices that has passed through this different milestones i can see the milestone summary i can see the passed milestone i can see how many invoices were actually rejected how many invoices went into error 
Also, if I want to check that how much time does it take for processing per invoice, I can check. So, here we can say that for per invoice, it, it takes 36 minutes to, to, to process. It can be more depending upon your business process. So, this is where I know that where exactly uh, the, the state is of my accounts payable department. As you have seen the demo, with the help of our integration cloud services, we can streamline the whole process. So, there will be no back and forth email required. As well as for a company, there will be no human error and there will be no loss of invoices and manager will be able to take appropriate action based on the analytic dashboard and for a company, it will save a lots of money at the end.